Yo, I'm right here called Sherer says, man, wrongly arrested was fired from job. Spartanburg County Sheriff Chuck Wright held a press conference on Tuesday afternoon to announce that his agency made a mistake during a recent drug roundup. Conference today is I owe a young man uh, a sincere apology because we made a mistake. And I don't want him, his family, his friends, or anybody that knows him to think that he did anything wrong in any way. His name is Olin Christopher Rhodes. This is a guy that did nothing wrong. Now, we had a warrant roundup last week, and his picture was put up there, and we had him charged with PWID uh, fentanyl, which is pretty terrible. Um, this young man turns himself in. His, his wife and his um, family were super nice to me, I have to say. Um, they asked a question on Facebook, have a question for law enforcement professionals about investigations. Um, my, one of my family members said, you may want to check on that, so I did. This lady was very kind and, and personally messaged me instead of beating me to death on Facebook, which they have a right to do. Um, but they're, they're good people. And um, this gentleman right here, uh, Mr. Rhodes, um, was terminated from his job. And I want to say thank you to the city of Malden for understanding that we made this mistake and not him and gave him his job back. So thank you for that. Um, they lost a little bit of money that we will recoup for them. Um, I want to show you, I really want to show you the guy that looks like him, but I have not 100% identified him, so I don't want to make the same mistake twice. Um, I just wanted to tell everybody that knows this man that he did nothing wrong whatsoever. He was not involved. Uh, it was a mistaken identity. Um, they look quite a bit alike. Uh, we were working with an informant who emphatically said, that's him, that's him, that's him. Um, the, the young officer that did this, very good investigator, just made a mistake. So the whole reason why I wanted to tell you this is I need everybody that knows this guy, and he will tell you for three years he's been just fine. He's not done any of that stuff, and he told me in my office, he said, man, that's my past, and, and that's how we got his mugshot. Um, I, I've always been a proponent. It doesn't matter what you do, how many mistakes you make, it's how you handle those mistakes. He has done a very good job. We caused him some grief, and I want to apologize to him and tell him that the Spartanburg County Sheriff's Department wants to do much better than that. Uh, we've had this to happen in the past. I really hope this never happens again. The chances are that this may happen again, but I'm going to do our best. I'm going to do our very best not to let this happen again. So. That's what I want to say. Um, he, he's not charged with PWID fentanyl. He's not got any charges on him because he's done nothing wrong. So there's the public apology. And I want to tell um, both of him and his wife and all of his family, you know, that I am very remorseful this happened. This was not done intentionally by no means. Very, very honest mistake. And at the right point, I'll show you his picture along beside the guy we were looking at and they're, you know, I understand why the mistake was made. Okay. So you had a question, man?